it, allow it. Like, let it come. Don't, don't try to push it away, try to distract away from it. You know? Even if it's intense, even if it starts to come and you can feel the intensity of it, don't, don't try to deflect away from it. I always tell that story when I was in Cincinnati the, at the time and I was sitting in the peace house and the fear started to come up. I lost my peace and, and the fear was coming up and uh, I was sitting in a chair and I said, I said to the ego, I'm not leaving this chair till you leave my mind. Nowhere to go, nothing to do. I mean it, and I, I meant it. I was not leaving that job. Nothing, nothing matters to me in this world. If my state of mind does matter, and I'm not leaving this chair until you leave. You know, is one of those. And it's great you can do that. Your mind is so powerful. You can like perfect love cast out fear. Just. Serious. I'm serious. I'm sincere about this. And it was, I, I did, it was true, I had nothing. You go, could what about this? Go ahead. Come on. Is that the best you can throw? I'm not leaving this chair. And then, you know, and then I didn't get out of that chair till I was in the glory. Again, showdown in the old OK Corral. Come on, <laughs> hit me with your best shot. I'm not leaving until you're leaving. You know, it's like, you know, in the end, you can do that with your mind. The, the ego is really not so formidable to a mind that desires peace. Uh, you know, the mind that desires peace is, is it's inevitable, is going to have that experience. And, and it's this compromise thing, as if somehow we're just going to let it come into our holy mind and camp out. <coughs> okay, you, you can have a little spot over there in the corner. No! You know, I am at home. Fear is a stranger here. You know, fear gets cast out. It's good to feel that empowerment. You know, people would say, "You better watch it. Don't talk like that about the ego, David. It's going to kill you." And everything. No, it's not. It's not. It, it's, Jesus said, "Be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. I have dominion over the world." You know. That's it's a beautiful teaching. Good cheer, dominion over the world, dominion over the ego, is really what he was he was teaching. Ego didn't have him. <laughs>